Hey YouTube! So I'm back with another tutorial. We're going to be making a or sewing a Alexander Wang inspired bralette. Like I said, this is the Filthy Broke fashion channel. Not Filthy Rich yet. Anyway, don't sleep though because it's coming. So basically I'm going to try to make it so simple that practically anyone of any age can learn how to do this you don't have to be a sewing expert or anything like that i'm going to make it very simple for you all so enough about that let's get started So you want to start measuring at the top of your chest to the bottom and I measured seven inches so on this piece of paper I've already started a pattern but I'm going to measure the long way and this seven inches will be the long way for that triangle as you see here and then I just add a 90 degree angle and that will make a triangle. Then I'm going to add a one inch seam on the outside of the triangle and that's just so when we hem we will have extra room and it won't get smaller. And I'm going to cut that out. And this is how both of your patterns should look. Next I'm going to take a piece of chalk and trace the pattern on the fabric. So here I'm cutting out four pieces of the pattern that we just drew. After you're done cutting, it should look like this. You should have two and you should flip them both where the pattern that we drew is facing up. So the chalk side should be facing up. Then you will start pinning on the long side. Please make sure it's the long side that you're pinning, the side that you measure with the measuring tape and pin them down and when you open it up it should look like this the breast part then sew it so now take your measuring tape and measure this part of your body here this is just for the part that goes under the boob piece or the chest piece and you're going to take that and measure the length whatever you get there and then how, about how wide you want it i think mine i measured four inches so i want mine to be four inches wide not too thick but not too thin either just right So here I'm measuring for the strap. I measured the top of my chest to the middle of my back and it measured 19 inches. I measured that on the fabric and then I measured two inches wide. So 19 inches long and two inches wide. And then I'm going to fold one side of the fabric and then fold the other side so that they both meet in the middle. And then I pin it and do a zigzag stitch. It needs to be zigzag simply because it looks much better and it stays together more. So it should look a little something like this when you're done pinning. So go back to the bra or the chest piece from earlier and we're going to make a hem so that they don't unravel, the fabric doesn't unravel or just look plain out tacky. And the inch that I told you to leave in the pattern, we're gonna go back to that and fold it over on that line and pin it so that you can have the hem as I'm doing here. Make sure you do it on both sides. So it should kind of look like a V or an A, whichever way that you're looking at it. So now I'm going to get the bottom piece of the bralette 
that you see here and I'm going to fold over the outsides and bring them in and then pin them so that it makes a hem and it looks nice and neat. So now I'm gonna get that same piece that I just hemmed and the two bra pieces. Flip the bra piece over so that the top of the bra piece and the top of the waistband are together. Now I pinned down the two bra pieces and if I when I flip it over, you can kind of see how this is going to go. Okay, so after doing that, this is how it looks now. And now it's time to add the straps. Like so. So now that I've pinned the strap to the bralette, I'm just gonna hand stitch it back and forth a few times to make sure that it's secure. You have the option of doing it with the sewing machine, but I liked this way better and quicker. Okay, so now I've sewn down both straps front and back. And now I'm gonna take the Velcro. Initially, I was gonna do, um, I was gonna do a zipper, but but a zipper was too much hassle. And remember I said I was try trying to make this as quick and as simple as possible. So I'm gonna take the Velcro as you see me doing here and stick it to the top side of the bralette, making sure to peel off the sticker so that the adhesive or the sticky part sticks to the other side of the bralette as you see here and then i'm just going to cut that bottom piece off so now you can't see the white part at all it's like it just goes there Ta-da! cut off all of the little scraggly pieces and strings and all of that as well boom there it is. <laughs> um, as you see here, I'm done. And I kind of don't like the part that's sticking out by my armpit. So I'm gonna fold that down. I'm gonna pin it and then just sew that piece together because I don't like it sticking out. Oh yeah, here it is. The annoying armpit pieces are gone now. Mine is kind of out, it has a little, you know, a little cleavage out, but you can cross it as much as you want. Say like if I wanted to do it like this, I would just cross them more back when I showed you to um, flip the bra pieces over. Yeah, so this is the end of my tutorial. I hope you guys like it. Once again, like and subscribe. Like and subscribe down below. Um, <laughs> that's all. Peace out from the Gene Queen.